Assalamualaikum dear viewers welcome from Zilka's favorite how are you and how is the life going on how are you handling your kids online education as in my previous videos i have facilitated parents and students to work on google classrooms i thought that i must guide the teachers how to work with google classrooms so they can better teach and guide the students so today's video is about the process to create class in Google Classrooms step by step and how to assign tasks there. Before starting, please don't forget to like, subscribe and click bell icon. So here we go with Google Classroom. Similarly like before, you have to type here Google Classroom and here you have the options you have to select google classroom and now we are in the classroom thing is that if you have already the classrooms they will appear over here but if you don't have any classroom this page will appear blank you have to press the plus icon at the right top corner click it there are two options join class or create as we are here today to create the class so let's click create class here you will get a dialog box there are some rules you have to read and then select then continue before starting the class you must know what will be the class name it can be according to your choice like suppose here we have class for like for general services so i can choose a name general lesson section you can choose any section subject for which subject you are delivering the lesson suppose we have math room like room 1 or 2 and it's optional you can also leave it then you have to press create it's processing just in seconds you will be there it's creating the class so here you have your new google classroom with the title of general class section a and it's for math you can see over here select theme if you will click select theme you will get themes already present in your system or in your mobile you can choose any of the theme according to your subject or according to your choice right so let's see we can go with it yes after selecting you have to click select class theme yes here is another choice upload photo if you want to upload any photo that is inside your mobile or inside your laptop inside your tab that is saved in your device you can click select a photo from your computer here you have choices even you can take the direct picture with the camera or you can have the video you can have the recorder or you can click the files if you have something saved in your system in your memory so suppose if we choose this picture it will be loaded there uh, here is an error we can go back again upload the photo drag a photo here files and then choose any picture which you would like for your lesson mm -hmm. suppose we have this one yes it's loaded now class 
picture is over here right you can change it later it's not a problem i'm just telling you the process right now your classroom is ready second thing is that how you can get the students enter in their classroom so look at the top you have three tabs stream classwork and people click people first option is teachers in the teachers right now only i'm here zilka favorites if you want to add more teachers here you can click the right plus corner and then here you will write the name or email you can get the email address of your teachers you can type over here and then click invite then those teachers were will be added in your classroom and they will they can be able to post the lessons same like you right second option here we have students the students which you want to enter there are two ways to let them enter to let them be a part of the classroom the first option is here you can see invite students or give them the class i can show you here yes this option invite students or give them their class code 2nt4aip the class code is given if someone is interested to join your class you can give this class code to your students they will join your class by selecting the option of join classes from the beginning right but if they have problem you can also help them you can also invite them how you can go to students add option that is at your right side right side of the students click it here you can add the email address of the student and then you can invite them by clicking the invite option and they will be added in your class so this is a simple way to invite your students to invite your teachers to let them join your class and they will be there now when your class is ready with your teachers and with your students or with your students just now next thing is that how to assign them work how to assign them tasks so let's click the second tab that is class work here you can create your class work so just click at the create option here you have assignments quiz assignment question material reuse post topic so whatever you want you can choose from here suppose you have to assign the assignment click over there here you have different options for general lesson here you can choose your lesson is for which class as i have many classes but we are working on general class so we will click general class then the number of the students you have got in your list it is for all those students that are added right so it will be for all the students next you have to uh type over here a title about your assignment that can be anything suppose it's about uh mm, tables secondly here you will provide the instructions to the students that what you are going to ask them what are the instructions over here suppose you are uh, asking them to learn the tables right then if you have something to add for like guiding material contents you can add from the add option that is like um, any worksheet any supporting material that is saved in your memory you can click add here you will go to files and select file from your device you will click it 
then you can take direct picture with the camera or you can go to the file option to choose from your gallery the material that you have to attach over here right so this is the way to upload secondly from add you can also go to youtube link and you can give the reference you can attach the reference video over here for the guideline of the students you can also copy the link over here so the students can follow those links for the guidance right so when you have done with your attachments you can give the points for the given assignment it depends upon you let's suppose let's suppose we have assigned marks 25 you have to give the due date over here as your submitted date will be like today is 30th march so that will be your submitted date so due date it depends upon you what you will choose suppose the next day is the due date then you can choose from here if you want to write the time for the submission due time you can also add over here it will appear then topic if you want to assign the topic that will come over here or you can create the topic like time tables right the next interesting thing is the rubric as the rubric is like your um, method how you are going to give the marks to the students what will be the policy for that when you will choose the rubric you can assign over there the different options for assigning them marks for giving them marks like for memorization there will be mark for um, if you have given something writing then writing the neatness will take marks if there is something like spelling you can give marks for spellings also so you can divide your total marks in different categories and you can uh, give that rules over here in the rubric part to choose and create the rubric in, in create rubric you will get the options you can create over there and then you can add so after this your assignment is ready that is tables now it is posted the students which are present in your student list they will be able to get those assignments to see those assignments in the classwork they will do it and they will submit it in my next video um, i will tell you that how the students how you will be able to check the submitted work and how to give them feedback inshallah tomorrow i will uh, share that video with you hope this video will will be helpful to create new classrooms according to your need um, you can also give your suggestions about the topics you want to get the guidelines um, so i can work on those videos write in comment box or inbox me on facebook at haya sehgal so um, hope you have a nice uh, lesson over there and it is understandable for you so take good care of yourself and your family fi amanallah